the first time what Roman glass was. And it took my breath away to imagine it, to think about it, to think about what we were actually bringing you. Just first of all, I want you to know these are sterling silver hoop earrings. They have these Roman glass charms or drops in a teardrop shape that are already included. This is the first day ever on five monthly payments. It's only $13.54 a month to try these. And I I don't know if these come yep. off. Yeah, they come off? yeah, absolutely. So you can it's wear removable. them with or without. Yep. But the thing about this is that it comes with a certificate of authenticity to authenticate what Danny is going to tell you right now. Tell us what Roman glass is. Assume they have no idea yep. because a lot of you may <laughs> be watching for the first time. Yeah, and the story actually started about 2,000 years ago. Let's talk history a little bit. Mm -hmm. 2,000 years ago, the Roman controlled most of the world. Among them was all the Mediterranean Sea area. You know, they were pioneers in many areas, they invented many things. One of them, uh, by taking sand and heat it in a very high temperature, over 1,000 degrees, they were able to create glass. And, uh, you know, to, to get the different colors, they used, the, you, they used herbs, uh, different herbs that due to eggs from, from Egypt and from all around the area uh, to get the colors of the glass. Wow. 2,000 years later, uh, we find in all kinds of archaeological digs, mainly around Jerusalem, the remnants of the glass. So what we do, try, touch this one. Wow. It's not, it's not sharp, right? No. Because they used only mineral and sand to create the glass. They did not use any uh, modern uh, chemicals wow. like, like they use today. Right. So 2,000 years later, we find it on archaeological digs, the remnants of the glass. So we excavate it from the ground, we bring it to the factory, we cut it, we shape it, and, and we make glass out of it. Here we can see, this is the way it comes to the factory. Oh, this is the wow. cam, they pull it from the ground. Now they, they need to sort all the different uh, uh, glasses. Now, the, this is the patina. You see how she peels off the patina? Right. And then she cuts it, you see, one by one to make sure uh, that it fits to the mounting. This is another pendant that we have on qvc.com. But then you can see, you can wow. get the idea how she gets the glass one by one. Then they cover the patina. Okay, you see how she does it one by one with like a little Q-tip? Right. Now, the patina, this is the layer that from the glass wow. being in the ground for 2,000 years, this is the mineral soil that was created. If you, if you can touch here, so all right. the pieces have some patina so we, we can peel it off. So we put it, they put it on the side, they cut the glass, they clean it, they shape it, they set it into the jewelry, and then they apply it back the original patina. Now, it's the first time that we've done hoops in Roman glass, which oh I think gosh. it's really an amazing, amazing story. I did it in a removable way, like a charm way. Mm -hmm. so